Hello my dear professionals. Today, we are focusing on how to implement file polling in web methods. Open Integration Server Administrator In the server menu of the navigation panel, click Ports. And then click on Add Port. Select Web Methods File Polling and Submit. Minimize the navigation panel for better view. A file polling port periodically polls a monitoring directory for the arrival of files. Integration server then runs a special file processing service against the file. Select the package to associate with this port. An alias for the port that is unique for this integration server. A description of the port which is optional directory on integration server that you want to monitor for files. Let's create one sample directory for polling. Copy the directory path. And paste here. When it detects a new file, integration server moves the file to a working directory. Optional directories are automatically created if no directory is specified. We can also specify file name filter, file age in seconds. Content type to use for the file. If you are polling for XML files, Set the content type to text slash XML. Then the XML content is passed as node to the service pipeline. Keeping the below parameters to default. Name of the service you want integration server to execute for polled files. The server executes the service when the file has been copied to the working directory. Let's create a processing service in the designer. For this, I am creating a flow service here. Since we are polling XML files and the content is passed as node object to the pipeline, creating node object as input. Save changes and copy the service name. and paste it in processing service. Provide the polling interval in seconds. Leaving other optional parameters to default. The number of threads you want integration server to use for a port. You can specify a value between 1 and 10, inclusive. Scroll up to the security section and specify run services as user parameter. Save changes. File polling port has been created with access warning. Let's edit the access mode field. You can add folders and services to allow list. Here I am setting access mode to allow by default. Let's return to port list. Now the access mode is changed to allowed. Before enabling the port, let's create some sample logic to parse the XML content. As we know that the XML content will be passed as node object to the service pipeline directly, I can use XML node to document service. And I will simply print the converted XML to server log for now.
our processing service is ready for test. Before placing a file, we need to enable the port. Port is enabled. Let's copy one sample XML file and place it in monitoring directory. File has been picked up. Let's check the XML content in server log. File content has been logged successfully. We can verify the content logged here against the file that we have placed. Thank you.